another video with Taya Everything. I am aka Mama Pain. Thank you for joining me on today's video and I'm out doing some walking therapy. And as you can see, it's a beautiful, beautiful 84 degree weather out here in Brunswick County. I am at Fash, oh no, not Fash, but it's Fish Factory Road. And I apologize, I didn't get the name of the park. I've been coming here for years, but I've not been here in a while, so totally forgot the name. But it's not that big of a deal because it's in Brunswick County. And the name of the road is Fish Factory Road, and it's straight. Check that out. Very loud boat. How did they know I was a, doing a recording? <laughs> That is a loud little boat. But anyways, it's on Fish Factory Road. You come in at the light, you take a left and you go less than a quarter mile. It will be on your left. You cannot miss it. Beautiful place to come boating, jet skiing, and walk your pets. There's a big park for your kids to play. You can come picnic. There's picnic tables, uh, clean restrooms. And uh, this is one of my favorite spots that I love coming to, to get away in today's world and all the stress and everything. So yes, I am out getting some fresh air and some wind uh, walking therapy. And uh, we got the most prettiest boats, sailboats. And I'm just walk just a little bit. I still have a lot more to walk. So I'm going to go around this beautiful, I mean the tree is dead, but man, does that make some pretty pictures or what? We got a metal type of rope from some ship. Um, right here, there's oysters on the ground. And I uh, found a big blue-legged crab that I had taken a picture of and I'll probably put that on this video before I end it so to see how we're gonna get around here let's go this way this is beautiful guys and it's perfect perfect weather absolutely gorgeous I am trying to just take you guys to some of my favorite hangout spots um, since I've lived out here in Brunswick County North Carolina for the past 30 years um, this is where I like to come and hang out look at this big tree big tree look how long this is finally fell I'm glad nobody got hurt I do have my son with me he's back there in the green somewhere I can't see guys I am blinded by the light and of course I got my sidekick do you want to say hello? Yes. So yeah, now that I've got past that big tree, we're going to walk around this way. And uh, I can see where a lot of the water has taken down a lot of the, the sand. Oh, the, it used to be a, the hill used to be so big, you, you couldn't even come down. And now it's like where you can just climb up. So yeah, we've had a lot of damage here from a lot of tropical storms systems that's come out here in hurricanes. The tide is out, as you can see. I don't know if it's still going out or it's coming in or what have you. We do have alligators here. And here comes a boat. And there's a uh, family fishing over here. But yeah, people come here to fish. And if you're asking me, do you have to have a fishing license to fish out here? Yes, you do. There would be one right here. Right when you turn on Fish Factory Road, you will see one where uh, it's, a, it's a bait shop where you can sign up to get your fishing license. Beautiful. Here's the uh, oysters, guys. Look at this thing of oysters. 
Then you got a family over there. They got their dog with them. Just enjoying a beautiful day before it gets cold because it will be getting cold soon. <laughs> Look at all the crabs. Look at all the crabs. They're running. They're running. Lots of crabs. I don't want to step on them. <laughs> That, oh my goodness, look at this. Look at this. Holy moly. Look at them all. <laughs> I don't want to step on them. Oh. Too cute. Holy moly. Look at the herd of them over here. <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> this is unreal. <laughs> Jesus. That's something else. So we've walked from all the way over there to now to the rocks. My favorite place to come chill out. This is a good place when the tide's out to bring some chairs and just hang right here in the shade and watch the boats come in and out. I just love this place. When I was a little girl, we used to go fishing, my dad and all four to five of my brothers. And uh, we'd go fishing in lakes and rivers and places like that with rocks like this. And my childhood memory of the rocks would be me sitting down in one of them. And they kept telling me, don't sit down because you're going to get your butt bit by a crab. I wouldn't listen. So I was tired. I played majority of the day because they would come all day and fish and I just hung out and fished with them I was like one of the boys so I sat down and sure enough a big yipe came out of me screaming it was the biggest crab with the biggest claw that took a chunk out of my butt cheek and I was a little girl I think I was about 10 11 years old and guys that was it was so funny it was so funny, but yet painful. So that was a good memory of me. Something I could always remember. That I will always talk about. Because that was something you can't forget. <laughs> On top of many other, many other stories that I, that I have. I just love, love, love the side. I love to hang out here. You do have the uh, small airport very close by, probably about a mile and a quarter from here. And all that is just nature, wildlife. There's your plane. Mr. Hollis, Mr. Pookie Hollis is having a great outing. He is loving it. What dog would not? And son's over there checking out. He loves to fish, so he's come out here and fished a few times. This is very interesting down here where the water has washed out the dirt and sand from underneath this tree and just left the roots all hanging. Perfect place for wildlife to take shelter. you do have woods. Here's a nice boat, y'all. Everybody out boating like it's summer. Wow, I've got my feet wet. We are on now the, the actual big open field full of grass and beautiful old trees. I've always talked about how I would love to own this property and build me a plantation home. I feel like I've been here before in my past life. And uh, I have such big dreams for this property if they would. 
anyways, now I'm at a second favorite place that I love to come and hang out for some stress relief, anxiety, depression. I've filmed here before and uh, it's just all round amazing place to be in Brunswick County. I am at the beach, Long Beach, North Carolina. And tide's out. There's my son. The tide is out, so we have the boaters off to the island right there. And people fishing. The beach is that way. You can hear the waves crashing. What do you think about this, Pookie? Do you love it? He loves it. But yeah, tide is out all the way because this is all muddy right here. And this is usually where the water's at when the tide's in. And um, all the way that way would be Holden's Beach, North Carolina. I'm at the very end of, I don't know if they call it the point, I just call it the end of Long Beach. And uh, like I said, <laughs> I, I just brain dead here lately since I've been so stressed out and um, can't remember a whole lot of anything. But here we go, guys. This is amazing. I come walking out and look at what I come out to. Isn't it gorgeous? Absolutely gorgeous. I'm not sure about how cold it is out here as far as the water, not the weather, because it's amazing out here right now. It's just, I don't know the temps of the water. How did it feel? Much better? Mud shoes. Mushy? Mud shoes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at your feet. Mud shoes. <laughs> Mud shoes. That's right. Mud shoes. Mud shoes. Mud shoes. You look Mud like shoes. you're coated and ready to be baked or fried. <laughs> Mud shoes. That is so funny. But yeah, guys, look at this. This is awesome. <laughs> Where are the parties at? And I can't believe there's not any more people than this out here. Get drinks at it. How's the water? Whoa! How's the water? Warm? Cold? Yeah. It's cold? Cool. That's where you see the most beautiful sunsets, right? Here. I mean, I'm talking about beautiful sunsets. So we're coming out further to the beach section area. So we just walk from that way and now this way. Gorgeous day. I can't stop. I can't. Keep saying that enough, guys. It's absolutely gorgeous today. And this is what I need. Absolutely need. It heals the soul. Makes you think of how much you should appreciate life and what you have. Because if I can come out here, take about 20 minutes to ride out here and enjoy this beautiful, absolutely gorgeous beaches and inlands and waterways and lakes, then I could say I'm blessed. So, there's not a whole lot of people out, just a few. But then again, nobody knew we were going to have this absolute gorgeous weather to come out here and do this. I had no idea it was going to be this this is beautiful. I thought it would be cold because it could be 80 in town and then you can come to the water and it, the temperature just drops. I know you can't swim in the water. Most people, crazy people will swim in the water like this one right here. I guarantee if you had swimming trunks and a towel and all that, he would jump in, right? Yeah. You would. You would. He's done it before, so he would. The waves right now in the current 
only because it curves right in here and goes into the waterway it's so wicked it's really wicked that tide current will take you out sad to say that many lives are lost out here on this beach every single summer I can't even imagine guys I couldn't when I come out here with the kids and stuff I'm on always just keeping my eyes out on it. I have a whistle sometimes and I blow it because I used to be a lifeguard back in the day. I know CPR and all that. But just the thought. And we've had a few close calls. And let me tell you something. That's something that I wish on no one at all. Not even on your worst enemy. But anyways... It is gorgeous, guys. We're coming right out to the um, to the front of the beach, and come on, boo. So yeah. All right. So we walked a little ways this towards the beach side, and lots of people on that side, and we're gonna go ahead and walk back. Um. Or just, I thought I'd just share a little piece of joy and smiles and happiness with you guys and show you where I like to hang out and how blessed we are to have these spots to hang out and come and enjoy. So, your sun's going to set right there goes up a little bit that way and it sits right over there so where's Hollows? There's Hollows I think he's tired and I think it's time to take him home and give him a bath and let him rest can say the thing for me I'm a little tired are you tired? no of course not you can keep going but me I come out today to walk off some pain um yeah I've been having a lot of kidney pain since yesterday and I'm not sure what's happening but uh come tomorrow if I'm hurting like this I will be going to the ER I'm very stubborn and I will not go unless I really must have to but with that being said guys thank you so much for joining us on this beautiful day and beautiful spots of Brunswick County, North Carolina. I hope you enjoy me for the next video. And that one video that I said I wanted to film of this thing I wanted everyone to see. It was closed today so I couldn't go buy what I needed. So I will just say I'll do that whenever I'm able to get it and not say that'll be on my next video. Anyways guys, thank you so much for joining me. Don't forget to share, like, comment, and give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and all videos. And subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to go to my Instagram at Mama Pain. Facebook group called Shadows Behind the Darkness. That's awesome. And I believe that's it, guys. So, until next time. Uh-oh, where's my dog? Sorry, guys. I'm getting a little out of breath. But until next time, stay positive, little, little, and don't forget to... Love yourself. Love yourself. Until next time, guys. Have a good day. Thank you.